Cause I get sorted But I can call you fams if you switch to you support it It's my number out of service, man This is a recording Used to have to hustle on my Set for the last half of the seventh, and here is Austin Nola. That's the third, and foul ball. That one fouled off. In the air, left field. Vaughn moving back, looking up, and he brings it in on the warning track. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there, that front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle the other way with some authority instead of a fly out to left. Got him looking. So he's gotten deep into this game. And at least so far, not showing a ton of signs of fatigue. In the air, out towards left center. Straw brings it in with a nice run. Welcome back and a new arm on the mound to start the eight. Nabil Prismat. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. And there's a hit. So a man on base to start the inning. Now it's Jose Ramirez. Got to be careful with a slugger like this because he can turn it into a three-run game in the blink of an eye. Fly ball down the right field line. If it's fair, it's gone. And that is gone. With a low 90s fastball, you have to live on the edges and hit your spots. If you don't, you'll get hit hard. Really good swing there. Patient, waited for it. It's like BP all over again. And no one can get there. It falls in. Now he'll turn for second. Not stopping. He's going for three. The throw to third, and he's out trying for three. Here's Josh Naylor. That one is absolutely belted. And it's gone. Well, he went up there, oh, oh, looking to do damage. I think he had his sight set on that pitch. He went and got it and circled the bases. New pitcher coming on, the veteran, Luis Garcia. He's being eased into the game here with the bases empty. And that's a base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Now the tag at second, and he's out, trying for two. Oscar Gonzalez digs in for the Guardians. That one the other way. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. And welcome back. Bottom of the eighth. It's Xander Bogarts now. Going one. Well, I say it's the best pitch in baseball. Strike one. You get ahead on a good hitter as well. He's a little bit more confidence to move to the at bat. Kicks and fires. To the right side. Steps on first for the out. So digging in, Jose Azokar. And first offering is fouled off. The wind of the pitch. There's the strike. Absolutely frozen on that heater right down the middle. And that's a pitch you're just not getting back. Now he's in a tough spot, especially after falling behind on a good first pitch. Next offering is downstairs. Well, that's kind of what you expect in an 0-2 count. Excellent job of the hitter to have the plate discipline to lay off of that pitch. In the air, left field. That one gets down for a hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Now the youngster wants Soto. 
late with the swing there. Now these guys definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap, but you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ball game. Oh, and two now. Ground ball right side could be two. There's one. Back to first for two, and that'll do it. Steven Wilson gets the ball now. Here's Mike Zanino. One for three. And a pitch. Fly ball down the line. And that is a foul ball. Wilson goes six feet, three inches, 220 pounds, and he was drafted in the eighth round back in 2018. Out towards left center, Azokar has this one sized up and puts the squeeze on that. One down. So in now for Cleveland, Miles Straw. Line drive. Dives and he can't hang on. He doesn't have a play. And so they end up with some speed on it first. And up next for Cleveland, Stephen Kwan. Swing and a line drive. Base hit out of the center field. And that's the second out of the inning on the force play. And at first, Ahmed Rosario digs in now. Line drive, and that's a base hit out of the center field. And the postseason success continues for him. They take the four. Bottom nine. Here's Manny Machado now. That's in there. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to commit to one velocity and stay there. Swings through that one. I always remember watching Johan Santana pitch, and when he was in his prime, you would see a lot of guys out in front, right-handers pulling that change up in the stands and then fouling the fastball the opposite field up into the stands. Toss the nailer. Machado out of the play. On the ground right side. Into the outfield. Base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Now it's Matt Carpenter. Nice stop. The throw. To first, and he beats it. Everyone's safe. And now it's Austin Nola. And first offering is fouled off. Just could not get in sync and even guess right. We talk about fires to second for one, and that's going to do it. It's all over. The Guardians are world champs. Congratulations to the World Series champions. Incredibly special team. So proud of these guys. I know the fans back in their hometown. Everybody going nuts right now. It's going to be such an amazing reception when these guys return home. Welcome back on the show as we see some of the final moments and reactions in this World Series clinching game. And now let's go down on the field where they're set to present the Commissioner's Trophy to the World Series champs. For Chris Singleton and our outstanding crew, I'm John Chompy. This has been the World Series on MLB The Show.
ain't no joke. I used to let the mic smoke. Call me. 